Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Lucy if you are new here and today I have got a huge home bargains haul. I absolutely love these videos. I did a B&M one last week I think it was, um, which I got some really nice bits but a few of the bits that I needed to get were not in B&M so we went to home bargains today. It wasn't actually the plan. Um, so the plan was just to have a chill day but I said to Matt, do you know what, I think we need to get some fresh air. Um, so we got in the car and we drove to um, a little village called Malden, if you're from this area. Um, I used to live there, but there's a really nice promenade there. Um, but actually on the way there, it started to chuck it down. So we didn't actually get to go for a proper walk. Um, but we did see home bargains and I thought, well, I needed to get a few bits. So there wasn't much of a queue. The way they've got everything planned out there is amazing. It's one in, one out. It was definitely not overcrowded inside and they had lots of really nice bits, hence two bags full of stuff. Um, it's probably the best I've ever found home bargains. So I'm really pleased with everything I got. Um, I got everything I needed to get as well, which was good. Um, so I thought I would bring you along and show you what I've got. Um, so without further ado, I will stop gassing and let's get on with it. So there's going to be no structure to this. I'm just going to literally pull things out of the bag and show you as I go. So first things first. <laughs> Pulled out the first one, not very interesting, but some deodorant. Um, I was running out and I saw this, so I thought I would pick this up. So this was £1.49 for a big one. Yeah, I always get um, this deodorant, so this is just a staple product of mine. So I've got some of that. Next thing, next, I got a um, fake tan mitt. I have, by the way, also apologies for my nails. They are awful. I'm gonna be doing a pamper session, so they're gonna get done on that. Um, but I got a fake tan mitt. Um, I think this is 99p. I got myself, which I thought was really cute, a little watermelon bath bomb. Um, love the smell of watermelon. I just thought it was really cute. So this is also gonna be part of my pamper session. That was £1.49. So next we have got some shower gel. This is an imperial leather one. Drop it like a sloth. Um, it's a tropical rainforest and water mint shower gel. Oh yeah, that's lovely. Oh, that's really nice. We, um, we actually really like, they do all different flavors. There's a unicorn one. Um, I can't remember the other ones, but Matt actually really likes them as well. He's the one that first started getting them. So um, we've not had this one before, so we got that. And and this was 99p for a big bottle. So the next thing I am so pleased with, it's something that I did not expect to find, but I didn't realize that um, Home Bargains did some hair care products. Obviously I thought they did shampoo and conditioner. Um, so I wanted to get myself some nice shampoo because um, with this color hair, you have to make sure you use good shampoo and conditioner, otherwise it will fade really quickly. Um, obviously with the wholesalers being shut, that's where I usually get my shampoo and conditioner from. Um, but with them being shut, I haven't been able to pick up any and I'm literally on the last, probably last drop of my shampoo so um, I was actually looking at these bedhead ones um, on the internet last night I was looking at cult beauty I was looking at feel unique but they were all for the set was about 25 pounds upwards which I know you obviously packs a big bottle this is a 750 ml bottle um, so don't get me wrong I know that's a really good price but for the shampoo and conditioner I was just I'm in an iron about it and um, this one is the color goddess um, the, sh the, the salon I used to work at where I trained, we had bedhead products so I know they are really good and they all smell amazing. Um, and I added it to my basket last night and I don't know what it was but something told me just wait, just leave it and I didn't go ahead with the purchase in the end. And one of the first things I saw when I walked into Home Bargains was these. I was so happy. This was, I believe, $6.99 for the shampoo and $6.99 for the conditioner. Yes, so $6.99 per one. So just under £14 for the set. I didn't get the Colour Goddess conditioner. I got the Colour Goddess shampoo and then I got the um, recovery conditioner. I always like to use more of a moisturising sort of treatment conditioner for my hair because it can get quite dry. Uh, where I was blonde for so many years, um, it does get quite dry every now and then, although it's in fairly good condition at the minute where I've not been styling it as often as I would in lockdown. Uh, but I do like to use a nice nourishing conditioner. Um, so I got this one. So that was just under 14 pounds for the pair, which is incredible. So I'm so pleased I did not go ahead with the purchase last night because I think I would have been <laughs> really annoyed with myself if I walked into Home Bargains today and saw these and I bought them last night. So 
that is fantastic. Um, so next we have got just a little pot of hand sanitizer. We were running out of this obviously where we've been using it quite often. Um, so we've got a little one of these. That was £1.69. On to the next, we have got a little wax melt burner, just a nice plain white ceramic one with little sort of in, indent of flowers, um, which is quite a pretty pattern. We've only got one wax melt burner. I've really got into them recently. If you saw my um, one of my previous videos, I was on about these, but um, we've only got one at the minute. So this one I'm gonna have in the bedroom, um, just so now obviously with Riley not being in our room, uh, sometimes Matt wants to play the PlayStation in the evening, as a typical bloke does. Um, so I thought it might be quite nice to have one in the bedroom on my bedside table um, that I can put on when I go into bed. I can just chill out and watch a nice girly film with some chocolate, maybe a glass of Beano. Um, so yes, yeah, so I've got one of those for myself. £1.99, which is fantastic. Then that's actually a really good price, so I'm pleased with that. I feel like I say I'm pleased with that for every single thing, but I genuinely am pleased with everything I've got, so <gasps> sorry if I'm repeating myself. Um, next we have a Mrs. Hinch favourite. We've got these Febreze air fresheners. I love the pink ones. The blue ones are nice as well, but obviously pink's my favourite colour, so I always pick up the pink. And this is a twin pack, and these were £3.49. I think that's quite a standard price for these. I'm not too sure, because it's been a while since I did buy a last pack, but um, yeah, so for two, so I think that's quite good. We have one of these in the bathroom, and we also have one um, in the hallway as you walk in, so you get that nice smell as you walk in. So, um, so hopefully my dad is not gonna watch this video, but obviously it's Father's Day coming up. Um, so I got him a World's Greatest Granddad mug. Um, obviously we might not be able to see them properly, but I'm hoping um, we might be able to just drop some presents off to the door for him. I have not seen, not even gone to the doorstep or anything of well, my mum and dad for the whole of lockdown, which is really, really hard. I'm in an ahhing about meeting up and obviously having a social distance get together in the garden, but um, I, my mum and dad just think it might be too hard for them to be able to see Riley, but not be able to cuddle him. So it's very sad, the situation we're finding ourselves in. Um, but hopefully I'm praying, obviously everything seems to be improving, so fingers crossed it will not be too much longer because I really miss them. And I know Riley misses them as well. Um, but yeah, so that's part of his Father's Day present. Um, this was £4.99, which I think is good, so. So the next thing I got, I actually saw on another person's home bargains haul was these makeup remover face cloths. Um, you might have already seen, but I did a video on my skincare routine. Um, but I actually saw these and I thought they're really pretty colours. Just It's just nice to use a hot flannel on your face every now and then. So I thought I'd pick those up and oh, they feel lovely and soft as well. So there's three in there and they were... That's $1.99 for three of those, which is a really good price. Uh, I don't know about anyone else, but obviously not been able to get to the um, nail salons or beauticians. My feet are awful. I need a pedicure badly. Uh, they were quite bad when I was pregnant because I had really swollen feet, so I didn't go and get a pedicure done at all, um, which I really should have done. Um, but yeah, they're really dry at the moment, so <laughs> random. Don't really know if you wanted to know about my dry, skanky feet, but there we are. Um, but yeah, I just got this foot pack. Uh, this was 79p and I just thought it might be quite nice. It's honey and almond flavour and it is enriched with vitamin E. So I thought I would give that a go as part of my pamper evening. So that was that one. Um, I also picked up as part of my skincare routine these little face sponges. Uh, they're cleansing and exfoliating ones so I can use those when I'm putting on my cleanser and my exfoliator. Um, if you've seen my skincare routine video, you'll know that I'm sort of really trying to be stepping up my skincare routine. Um, so I thought that would be a great tool to use as part of that. So for six sponges, that was 79p. You literally cannot go wrong. So back to hair care products and <laughs> seeing this really reminds me of one of my good friends Carly. Um, when we trained together in the salon, she was obsessed with this. She had or has beautiful long hair and she always swore by this and it just reminds me of it. So I'm going to have a little whiff just to bring back those 
<laughs> Isn't it funny how a smell can just bring you back to a place <laughs> in your life? Um, but yeah, she absolutely swore by this and I liked using it on my hair as well. But this is the After Party, which is a smoothing cream for hair. So once you have dried or straightened or even curled, whenever you've styled your hair, just pop a tiny bit of this into your hands, rub it in and just smooth it through the ends and it just smooths all the hair over, makes it smell amazing, just makes it look nice and smooth and shiny. So this is such a good product. So Cardi, if you're watching this, made me think of you, girl. And this was £4.99, which I think is fantastic price for this. So you've already seen that I picked myself up a fake tan mitt. Um, so this is the um, product I got, which is a St. Moritz, and this is the Gradual Develop Streak-Free Tanning Lotion. Um, I used to use fake tan every weekend, obviously going out the weekends, uh, but I haven't for a couple of years now. Um, I just don't really go out anymore. <laughs> It's a simple answer to that. Obviously more so at the moment, but I saw this and I thought, I like these St. Moritz products. I used to use their um, wash off tan. So I didn't even realize they did this, but I just thought if I can just pop some of this on just to, I'm just feeling very pale at the moment. So hopefully this might help me spruce myself up a little bit. And this was, that was £2.99 for this bottle. Back over to the bed head products and I needed some hairspray. So I got this one, which is the Hard Head Extra Strong Hold Hairspray. If you haven't smelt bed head products, you really must do because they all... <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, I'm having one of those days. Um, I'm just gonna spray a bit of this as well because this really reminds me of my friend as well. <laughs> Even for a hairspray, which really, hairsprays don't smell nice, do they? But that just smells immense. So, yep, so this was £4.99 as well, which for this big size, this is 385 ml, but for that big bottle of hairspray is really good. So, as I mentioned, if you haven't seen my videos, um, I've got a little boy who is six months old. So we just wanted to just get a few more little books for him and they had quite a few lovely children's books in Home Bargains. So the first one we got, which for £1.99 was my first colour book. And it's just got all these colours and items in there. And they're nice bright colours, so um, he's really getting quite interested in books and everything, so I thought that was really nice. And it's something that will last him for ages as well. For £1.99, I thought that was a brilliant price. Um, but actually, it says on the back for six months plus, so do you know what? Oh, oh, oh didn't realise that, but it's actually got little bits you can feel as well, so it's good for the, their sensory and having little different textures that they can feel. I'm really pleased with that. That's actually better than I thought it was going to be, so what a barg. And next I have got um, one of my friends, Charlotte uses this and she swears by it, it's the Dr. Paul Paul Lip Balm. This is for lips, cheeks and cosmetic finishing with a hint of a tint. And this is, uh, this is the Rich Mocha Balm. So I believe it comes out, this is a sort of color it will come out, but they're just really good. Um, Dr. Paul Paul are really good lip moisturizers and lip balms. So they're cruelty free and vegan as well, if you are interested. And this was, £2.49. Just picked us up some hay fever and allergy tablets. Don't know about anyone else, but we are suffering so bad with hay fever at the moment. You run out of these, so we needed to get some of these. And these are 14 tablets in a pack, and they were they were 79p a pack, so that's nice and cheap. Um, so I needed some window and glass cleaner, so I managed to pick up some of this Star Drops one. Um, I have used the Star Drops products before and I think this is another one Mrs. Hinch swears by. Um, gotta love Mrs. Hinch. And um, I needed some of this, so saw that and got that. And I think they're really reasonable as well. 99p for that, so that is perfect. I'm so sorry guys, I'm like one bag down. <laughs> I told you this was a huge haul, so please bear with me. Um, <laughs> my favourite chocolate. Yes, yes, yes. It's going to be part of my Sunday night pamper night. Chocolate has got to be involved. So, Matt got himself a little Coca Cola air freshener for the car. Um, quite cute, really, isn't it? He loves a car air freshener as well. And this was one pound ninety-nine. Okay, one bag down. I don't think there's quite as much in this bag, but I could be very wrong. Um, so in my B&M haul, I picked up some white 
pillowcases, but they didn't have a um, mattress sheet, so we had those in Home Bargains, and it's just a plain white double fitted sheet, which is exactly what we needed, and this was £4.99, which I think is great for a plain white fitted sheet. So. We needed some more fairy washing up liquid. I have a dishwasher, but obviously washing up for Riley's bottles and bowls and everything. Um, so we've got a nice big one of these in the Citrus Grove flavour. And for a nice big bottle of washing up, £1.49. So next we have, I've been seeing people talking about these all over social media. I finally got some. This is the Fabulosa. Um, this is the spring blossom flavour and this is just a um, surface cleaner, Night kills 99.9% .9 bacteria and spring blossom flavour. Have a little cheeky whiff. Oh, yeah, that reminds me of something but I can't quite think what it reminds me of but that smells incredible. Um, this was the only scent they had. I was really hoping to get, I think they do a coconut one and there's a unicorn one as well, which is the one I did want. Um, but this smells amazing as well. So um, I always like to have quite a good stock of cleaning products. Um, I think I've just put someone out myself. Um, I always like to have quite a big stock of cleaning products. Um, so I'm excited to give that one a try. And that was 89p, 89p, seriously. Bargains all over the shop. <laughs> this is the most exciting one. Um, I love, 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 love gin. I know lots of people do. Um, I was just saying, me and Matt both love gin. Um, and my favourite, favourite gin is Palmer Violet. And look what they had. Um, this was £7.99. And it is a 500ml bottle. I love this gin. I am excited to have some. <laughs> um, I drink my gin with lemonade as well. I don't like the bitter taste of tonic water. And this and lemonade, just <laughs> perfect. So $7.99, like that's such good value. <laughs> I didn't even see Matt sneak these in and, and serves him right because they're all squashed. Jammy Joeys, out of date Jammy Joeys. 3rd of May, 2020. Don't even know what they are, I've never even heard of them, but they're squished anyway, so I think he's actually gonna be quite gutted about that. Has anyone heard of a Jammy Joey? Because I haven't. Not a bit of me, I'm not gonna lie. Three more things and then we're done. Um, so this is something I've been wanting to get for a while, so I've got myself like a little planner. This says things to do today, and it's got a lovely marble print on the front, I love marble. Um, and it's just got things to do, a little like a to-do list that you can tick off. Um, I find these make me so much more productive. If I start the day with a list of things that I wanna do and I just love that feeling of ticking something off a list, knowing that it's done. I use these all the time at work as well. Um, I write down things I need to do and I just love that feeling of crossing it off. So I'm gonna really start to use these. I'm really pleased with that and there's loads of pages and I think that's £1.99. £1.49. So, um, and the last two things are for Mr. Riley. Um, so, a couple of books. We've got Danny the Digger. This was 59p. And just a cute little um, book about diggers. Yep, so that's good for 59p. And then, last but not least, we've got a sloth called Bob <laughs> for 69p. Um, and another really nice, bright coloured book. Yeah, so so that is the Home Bargains haul complete, guys. So I hope you've enjoyed watching this video. I hope you've enjoyed seeing all the bits we've got. As I've said many times, I'm so pleased with everything I got. Um, so yeah, I hope you are all safe and well, and I will see you next time. Bye, guys.